So what is stronger, gravity or magnetism? Whether they're sitting down and doing arithmetic or they're sitting down and doing English, lit, whatever it is, I mean, it's just, yeah, I mean, it's just about giving them access to things that are going to help them grow. And everything starts with imagination. If you can inspire them, it, it doesn't really matter what they're learning. If, if, they feel, um, if they feel involved in what they're doing, if, if, they're, if you can instill passion and encourage it, then you have a lifelong learner. It's hands-on. Um, they're totally engaged in their learning. Um, they are excited about it. Um, they can just provide opportunities here I can't do at school. I'm pretty excited about this because it's giving the kids an opportunity and exposure to new and exciting stuff that's being done in technology and they're learning this stuff at a younger and younger age. I mean even just you know the kids have wanted to know about a 3D printer and so just the idea of being able to bring them here show and show it how it works I mean that's exciting to them. It was really exciting for them to see a lot of this and uh, gave them some exposure to, I mean, skills that are entertaining, but they're also very useful. It's engineering, it's science, it's physics, it's on and on and on. Uh, we're, we're a lucky place. And, uh, you know, that I've, I've said it before, but, you know, we, we want to be that community resource center. We want to be right there with museums and libraries, and we want people five years from now to say museums, libraries, and makerspaces, because, it's the 21st century and that's where the world is going and we got to keep up. Schools should definitely bring their kids here. It's a good way to get your kids engaged. Once you get them there, then it's 10 steps forward. There's something we call the aha moment. So when you're working with them and you're showing them something and you see their faces are crinkled up and you know they're trying to understand it and then suddenly you see that aha, they get it, it's that aha moment. You know, that's, that's what it's all about.